Hello and welcome back to Code Buds. Code Buds. We had a slightly harrowing, but um, still. I was together. calm the whole time. Yeah. Not even mildly concerned. Not even a little bit. Ooh, what's that? That is Eat Freehold. We could go there. It's a little bit dangerous to get there. Um. I I don't uh, no. Nah, mm. Now wouldn't be a terrible time to go there. Um, we are the closest we're this, gonna be. All the stuff that's over here. Well, uh, if this series continues to be successful, then we will check out the pink place in the right side. Um, the green stuff, uh, I mean, it looks like jungle, but do you, do you see how it is a little bit different? Yes. It's deep jungle. Mm. And it's twice as spicy with the twice the dangers and death. Three times the fragrance. And what? uh Eat Freehold mills in the center of the Palladium Reef, um, which is surrounded by Lake Hina Himnam, uh, which are both pretty spicy. We could go there though. Nom nom nom. You won't even let me play in the river, so like it's fine. Well, I'm just thinking we're, we're as close as we're ever going to be to eat freehold for free. So um, if you want to follow those mountains to like the corner of the Palladium Reef, we'll be very close to getting there pretty safely. Yep. Get in, in retrospect, we probably should go somewhere and save. Well, this is saving because we're going to checkpoint when we go to eat freehold. All right, it's, so I'm going to keep following these mountains? Yeah. I mean, this is... It's a risk, but I, I think we'll be okay. H how about this? Um, look in your skills for a moment. Ooh, I do have an attribute point also. Okay, we have some skills. Do we have wayfaring yet? Um, I, think we, I think I made you take it. I don't think you made me take it. I think I agreed to take it along with something you didn't want me taking. Well, it's the kind of thing. Wah, wah, wah. Wah. Um, let's take rivers and lakes. It's only 50. It will yeah, make, okay. It'll make this next um, little journey slightly less spicy. <laughs> I like that. Some kind of Pikmin enemy. Um, We're good. Okay. What else? What else? Where else? Where am I? Well, uh, before we deviate from the deviation, mm -hmm. let's 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 get to Eid. Fine. But. Oh. Huh. Well. If we put that attribute in intelligence, we will still be four points away from tinkering three. Yeah. Or it'll be... It's... Uh, tinkering three is, like, really only doable if you start your character at, like, 25 intelligence. It's such a bummer climbing up there. Is there... Well, what else am I going for, really? Um... There's probably still stuff in cudgels we would like. We would probably want some stuff in shields if you continue want to continue using shields. Um, like slam is pretty I mean, good. I'll never get demolish. I can get slam already. Yeah, demolish. I mean, never say never. You're probably closer to twenty nine strength than you are twenty nine intelligence. I think. I think by one. Okay. Well, I mean that's fair. Um. There, let me, let me think. Uh, let's go to Eid. Fine. Fine. Straight shot to Just the straight shot, building. Yeah, yeah. There's no good way of doing this. No. <laughs> no. Fine. Oh, uh, I'm not seeing anything immediately dangerous. We might actually want to do our drinky exploit to 
not be lost anymore. All right. Well, you know what? We need we need a good we need to make a good. While I'm doing this, Google like pictures of Batman drinking water. They must exist. Look, look, look. I wanna I wanna friggin' cool transition while this happens. Look, 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 look. I gotta, I gotta eat first, don't I? Yeah, you do. Um, yep. I'm sure there's a pretty good... Isn't there... There's like a really well animated um, pic of Batman eating a chili dog, right? Or some kind of taco? I can't remember. That's the one. That's the one. That's the one. Forget it. Let's drink some water along with Batman. Batman says, hey, kids, you should drink at least 8 to 25 full liters of water every day in order to maintain a healthy and balanced lifestyle. Let's drink some water. Look, 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 look. Look, 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 look. Or we landed in a pretty a good place. Wet prison perch? Oh, we're fine. They're they're kind of uh, confined to that uh, pool of algal water. Mm. Owl, cool. Is that is this anything? How much married with kids say. have you have you ever watched? I, I you mean married with children? Yeah, that's the one. Sounds like more than you. I've I've watched. Quite a few seasons of it, actually. I'll have you know. Recently. Mm, What's happening over there? I don't know, but I don't like it. We're going to continue not... Th whatever that is. I'm going to drink our uh, 10 to 25 drams of... I'm not lost anymore. All right, let's leave. Let's... Leave. Fine. You never want to do anything fun. All right, there we go. Oh my god. I was in favor of going, going to in freehold. Yeah, yeah, we're going in. We're going in. We did it. Wow. Look wow. at that guy. He's a big frog. Yeah, there's frog lads here. Oh, when one of those guys. This is kind of like uh, the six day stilt. Um, there's lots of places hey. to check out. What do you look like? Being safe and free as wood smoke. Uh huh. Hated by the seekers I, of the sight of this way. I like this guy's fine. Guy I feel vibe. like I'm probably not on good. What about the villagers of Wapper? Uh, I never like losing reputation with villagers, but I don't know. Loved by denizens of Eid Freehold. Sure. Good. I. You know what? I like frogs. Let's do it, frog. Yeah. I like how the frog, the frog lad, uh, have names that sound like frog noise. Gwick. I was already in a bad way with the villagers of Kwepper. Apparently. They must be rude. They must be rude guys. Mm, or just they don't like a lot of people. We could learn tongue in cheek. You could. And throw some secrets at them. It's always good. Alright, I mean, there's a lot of stuff to do here. And none of it really pertains to our current quest. But, um, you know, we were going to have to come here anyway, eventually. This is, uh, I think, currently the most... Um, the most advanced settlement in caves of cud tier wise like you'll find people that sell end game gear here um it is at least a, a notch or two above ezra i don't know if there's too many uh, associated quests with this place and i don't think that it actually is required to come here in order to do the main story quest but that's speaking as someone who doesn't yet hasn't yet played the uh Final mm -hmm. quest line. Oh, I don't know what's going on there. You're getting attacked by fairly advanced I, creatures. Some, some perches were punching me. Yeah. I don't know why this you're... This is bugging me, so I'm gonna... 
I, I would say maybe don't do this while you're being attacked by things. I have to do something. I can't move. Right. Um, well, let's just drop something real, like, that we don't care about. What's in our armor? Oh, oh yeah. You're... There you go. Perfect. It's probably what made us over encumbered in the first place. Apparently not on good terms with fish, and there's some here. Lol. <laughs> I saw that coming a mile away. I was like, you're going to walk over that tree, and it's going to make you over encumbered. <laughs> uh yeah 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 I mean, you're not being attacked so if you want to deal with the situation now you can i just it's bugging me i i i don't blame you i just uh i i will um i, w I will not condone you doing water management or liquid management while you are being attacked is the only thing and i don't know how spicy the perches are Okay. All right. Um, uh, I'm one, two. We could disassemble some grenades. Yeah, we're, we're not wearing that currently because that was the arm that had Pax Clank on. Mmm. So I made the right choice. Yeah, I'd say you did. We could. All right, we could drop the crocuses for now if you want. We're gonna sell. Yeah. We're gonna sell the ape fur cloak. We're picking those up before we leave. I don't want your stupid shoes for jerks. Wow. Can I walk through this? Yes. Cool. I just want to auto explore. Um, you can try. But it seems to be. A, I did try, and I was fighting fish and picking up trees. Can I turn harvest plants off? There you go. Anything else that's going to pick up? No. Well, metal folding chairs. You're good. I wonder if you can turn scavenger off. Well, I can turn off a rifle through trash. Do, 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 do. Well, that's not really what we want. Do, do, do. I love I love Eid Freehold's vibe. This place is is really cool. Um, we're gonna want to find the shopkeeper that sells a recoiler here, and then I'm gonna probably recommend we recoil probably to Jopa. And I know that's gonna bother you, but there's a specific reason for that. Do 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 do. Uh, you'll notice a lot of staircases. So all of those staircases lead to a specific shopkeeper um mm -hmm. i'm pretty sure the one in the top left is like a general salesman one uh there is a tinker one we'll definitely want to uh talk with them i think the tinker one is in the top right corner and we'll you know want to sell some stuff columbarium and we could check that out i mean there's lots of things to look at here there's tons and tons of cool stuff. Over here, so let's... Whoop. So yeah, this is like, um... I guess a crypt? You can look at those jars, they'll have something to say. Yeah, it's a crypt. I stared, gaping. Sit upon your own blood, sir. Oh. Even blood as thin as mine might drive me. You could do an auto uh, explore here in case there's any more. Oh, okay. That was it. Nope. That's it. You may not. I want that on my tombstone. <laughs> you may not. You may not. Please do not. I go up. Oh, I'm up here. Do not walk in that clam. I, I was, I know that that's a weird thing to say, but I just, I wanted mm. to let you know in case it happened by accident. What do you got? Nothing. Nothing, I guess. I'm going to bug you, mister. 
What's this oh, one say? Oh, 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 library. Library. I don't think that there are free books there. Down. But you can read. I think that guy, maybe you can buy stuff from? Maybe it's a book binder? No, never mind. Huh. I Weird. can buy a net. Boop, 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 boop. Nice boop. library, mister. I love that library. Nice library. All those, uh... All them fancy book learning. <laughs> well... I'll all those little squares are holes, by the way. They lead to the uh, conversation pit. Mmm. So, I like that there's just like, you know, fast travel holes that all lead into the, like the, the coziest little pit of people you can imagine. Look at it. Isn't that cozy as all heck? There's some bizarre trees here. Or, uh, sorry, not trees. Chairs that you kind of only find here like it's quite rare to find some of, yeah we don't want to we don't want to with all of that I, when did i get on such bad terms with fish i don't know i think we probably pissed them off at some point is that a jeweler um guy with the like pink it's an astral tabby um even if you even if they didn't shy from you you probably couldn't pet them anyway because they perpetually exist in a phase yeah, him. Oh, oh, we got a jeweler. Let's sell some stuff to them. Heck okay. yeah, bud. You have a jeweler at Eid Freehold. I'm so excited for you. Um, So we can sell our thermoelectric cells. This is the whole reason I have you make thermoelectric cells, by the way, is to sell them. Because it's one of the easiest ways to carry lava, which is a very, very expensive or valued good. Um, you can use them as cells, but I don't know if they're, I don't think they're particularly useful. In fact, I think biodynamic cells are technically better. Might be wrong about that. Um, let's just like do that and see if we can buy all their stuff and how much, see how much we have left. By all their stuff, do you mean just, even this weird artifact? Goods. No, not 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 the weird artifact. Just just the trade goods. You could arguably pass on the bracelets because you're actually overpaying for them. Yeah, it's pretty good. I guess we're actually trading down in a way because oh no, the thermoelectric cells are more are more weight. Um, I guess you could buy a beaded bracelet to even things up. May as well. There you go. So that's, that's nice. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm grateful you finally have a jeweler. Jewelers are, are a great way of just like condensing your sellables into, um, you know, better currency, basically. We could buy some of their other goods, but you're overpaying by a large margin. Mm. Um. But yeah, let's let's uh, continue our ex our explore. There's a lot of lot of cool things and people to to check out. Emerald Gunner Knight Templar. Um. It says trade goods, but it's it doesn't have a yellow dollar sign, and that means you're overpaying for it technically. That being said, I mean we've got the extra money. We it is still worth quite a bit. So like up to you. We, if we had more stuff to give, check out that uh, that pink chair. By the way, I love that one. <laughs> Stealing the water out of the hookah. It's a storm chair. Ah, the storm chair. Isn't that good? Well, check out the one above you as well. Chair bear. Chair bear. Mm. <laughs> are you... I like how unamused you are by all of this. But the what about the one to your right, the yellow one? Check that one out. It's a bedger. Hmm. I see. 
Yo. Come on. This guy just like comes to the conversation pit. Is uh, refuses to be amused by any of these colorful sitting arrangements, and then steals the water out of all the hookahs. What if I fill it with wine? I don't know if that works. But you don't know that it doesn't work. What would happen in real life if you filled a hookah with wine? Uh... It would probably make lightly wine tasting smoke because you're just you're just pulling the smoke through it. Right. I don't know. I'm not a I'm not a hookah expert. I've used one all of like one time. And I assume it's just a classier bong, if I'm being honest. Yeah. Um anything else down here? No, um, the, all of the different sections of the first or the bottom floor of um, Eid Freehold are kind of modular in design, like they're all se uh, separated from each other. So you got to go up and then go to where you want to go and then go down. OK, this is a good one. This is the this is the tinkering guy. Bepsi widget or Bepsi widget. Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. So we want the small stone. We do want that. I know it. Same situation as before. We know what that is, so we don't need to pay him to identify it. Or, uh, yeah, floating glow spheres, that'd be, like, perfect. Perfect. Okay, what else do we have? Um, night sight Willowy? interpretator. Willowy? Uh, it's okay. It makes things lighter. I know that sounds really good, and it might be good for something like, um, a full right plate mail. So, I guess so. We could consider that. It's not that expensive. Yeah, all right. Let's give it a go. We might want to consider um, drinking our identify artifacts meal to um, mm. see what he's got. Okay. So, I keep telling you not to buy this thing, but you keep not finding one. So, maybe you should just buy it. I'm just going to buy it. Sounds good. Um, ouch. Ouch. Sorry. Uh, b -b 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 nuggies? Yeah, throw some nuggies at that. Throw all your copper. Yeah, always get rid of your copper nuggets first. At a certain point, copper nuggets are almost not even worth buying. Because you just get rid of them instantly. If I'm buying an advanced toolkit, should I just get rid of the basic toolkit? Yeah, that makes sense. I don't think they stack. I'm sure someone told me they did stack. I'm sure they're going to tell me again that they do stack, but I don't know if they do. Silver nuggies? Yeah, throw the bracelet at it. And honestly, you could stand to shed some. Oh, I guess that would take, be all of your. Yeah, go ahead and throw the silver nuggets at it and then leave it at that. Shedding 100 drams would be good for you. Okay. okay. Now we want to go eat a, eat a, eat a meal. Yeah, we want to we want to know what, it, what he has. Anywhere to eat here? You could probably just make a campfire there. Feels rude. It does feel a little rude. Um, 
Get auto explore the zone. Maybe there's a camp. Maybe there's a clay oven here somewhere. Do like a point of interest. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. That's just telling me everything, huh? Yeah. And there's no clay oven. You know what? Maybe it's not rude. Maybe he could stand to have a campfire in his workshop. Uh, we're gonna be cooking. Yeah, we'll probably also want to favorite this one Do we have any bananas? I guess I made you buy a lot of bananas We must have bananas There it is Yeah, we have seven bananas left So viewers at home if you don't know what you're what, what we're doing we're Eating a meal that, um, at 25% chance, identifies all artifacts on the local region. So that we can find out what this guy has. Because, I mean, we could, like, have him identify them at cost. But when you get to artifacts that cost, like, above a thousand drams, then they'll charge you, like, 40 drams to identify it. And it's really not worth it. Uh, I just realized you're gonna, you're gonna puke in this guy's workshop. Oh no, we got it on the first try. First, first go. So. Emisoft, grenades mid tier, motorized trades, cathedral with sapphire tracery. I think that's really good. I'm gun fact, rack? I think the gun, gun rack is good in the cathedral. What does that one do? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Holy shit. I would I can't use wings though. You gain the ability to fly. Oh. Then I don't need it. it You're gives, right. It gives you the ability to fly. It gives you plus 100 move speed, plus 50 hit points. Ego. It gives you concussive force. It is also licensed points 12 though. If this <sighs> implant can't be uninstalled worth knowing. But it seems them. like we wouldn't we wouldn't ever want to. Yeah. No kidding. This thing is amazing. Um, I think we can almost afford it with that, but um Yeah, that's a thousand drams. Also, well, um have a quick look at the motorized treads. They're also kind of fun. Faster moving. Oh, but I can't wear shoes. You can't wear shoes, it's true. Um there's also I believe uh, special equipment in the world that gives you guarded treads. Um, so it gives, it lets you, uh, basically armor for your treads. Okay, so I can't do gun rack and get their Yeah. Because they're both the back slot. But it feels like this is a pretty high tier good back slot. Yeah, it really is. Extra uh, plus one hundred move speed is actually just like absurdly powerful. I, I you know, it'd well, be hard to top see, that. Let's see if we can even hit it. Well, we, I think you definitely have enough. Doop 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 doop. I'm just vibing with this music right now. You could just throw all your trade goods at this. Hmm. I won't lie. We're not. We don't have. We didn't get as far with that stuff as I thought we would. Well, we've got some pretty expensive books. We do. Um, generally speaking, don't want to sell those. Uh, shoot. I don't think we have. Could sell this point defense drone. Yeah, we could. Did we make that? Make a new one. Well, one of the reasons it's worth as much as it is is because it's got a nuclear cell in it. Mm. But I don't, I don't think that that would be a great idea. Because you don't want to lose the cell, or you just think we'll never be able to make a point defense drone again. Um, like I don't doubt that we would be able to make a defense drone again. We can probably. 
All right, go ahead. Go ahead. Hey, if you don't want, we don't no, got it. No, no, no. I could sell a bunch of freeze grenades. Yeah, that would get us about another two hundred drams. Go ahead and sell the point defense drone. For this thing, it's worth it. And the thing I'm, I'm worried about, you could sell sell all your pickled mushrooms. How about that? They'll they'll probably be worth quite a bit. Uh, maybe not as much as I thought. Yeah, that's not worth it. I was just saying we could probably cook with those. Okay, I mean, so it gets that's... me over two thousand. Okay. Um, I have a lot of star apple jam. Sure. Yeah, let's let's sell like a hundred of those, or even like two hundred. Fifty-five servings is probably enough, and you'll always get more. We're doing a lot of inventory management in this episode, but I mean, like, come on, Cathedra. This is a big, exciting purchase. Sure is. Uh, don't bother with the vine wafer. It's not worth anything. Um, mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, if you sell the point defense, you'll you'll be there. You'll get it. Could sell the wine. We know where to get more. Yeah. That's always what I tell myself. I'm like, I know of a good tile in Rainbow Wood that has wine. But like, the thought of going back there always fills me with some dread. Did you, did your Eat Freehold Recoiler come with a nuclear cell? Yes. Wow. A low oh, one. A low one, okay. We can disassemble Should I... that. Well, we could... No, we could disassemble that. Don't don't sell that, for sure. Dang, I could take out the good one from that other thing. Yeah. We'll get more of those. When we do some ruin diving, we'll get some more nuclear cells. And in fact, we're 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 still ho holding out hope that we can get some antimatter cells. <laughs> yeah, sell all your bear jerky. I mean, you're getting pretty close to not having to sell the uh, point defense drone. I'll give you that. Um. You hate lead acid cells. I'm yeah. not using them. Yeah, we do hate lead acid cells. Let's get rid of those. We hate lead acid cells, both of us. I honestly don't care either way. <laughs> yeah. All right, you want to sell some books? Sell those top two, not the yellow ones. We need 150 more. So close. I think we know how to make a precinct navigator. Uh, I don't think it's worth selling that. Uh, dried law petals. Those are worth something. I don't... I mean, I am sure they're worth cooking with, but I don't think we will. You could just sell all of them. And I might honestly say the same for fermented yonder cane. And uh, go ahead and sell the eater's flesh. We don't need that again. I know it's only three dollars, but you know, we're getting there. Uh, also, I might suggest throwing all the fermented yuck wheat stem. Or like at this point, we're we're just like consolidating inventory space. All right, we did it. You didn't sell the point defense drone. I know you love it so much. It's really good. But I will say. Um, our odds of using it have now decreased by quite a lot because that thing requires 12 license points. So unless we like use the magnetic core sooner than later and then pretty sure the magnetic core was going to be our body, right? It's like it requires a body slot. Yeah. Yeah. But the 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 cathedra is backslot, right? 
Mm hmm. Okay. All right. Well, I really didn't expect um, that. But we did it. I, we did do it. I'm I'm honestly tempted to like, like, do we want to throw scroll bound by a strand of whatever and buy the motorized treads? But I don't know how you feel about the motorized treads. I you like won't get feet. to wear shoes. Yeah, you can't wear you can't wear shoes anymore. Oh, he's got There's a no coming near, back. He's got a nano near animator. Love. I we love we love that. What is it? It lets you animate things. Oh. Expensive. It is really expensive. You basically can create a have an army of walls following you around. Um well. this episode's running long. That's partially my fault. We didn't actually accomplish any story stuff, but that's okay. We got a cathedral with a sapphire or whatever. So, and we got the mm -hmm. Eid. You got to see Eid. We're not even done in Eid because there's at least one more merchant. Uh, well, we could check them out real quick if you want. I don't think we won't be able to That's buy them. I mean, you can fast forward through the shopping part. We don't need to. Yeah. Is it those stairs over there? Yeah. To our right. I guess there's one more to your south. There's actually, yeah, there is one important thing that we want to find or uh, see before we leave. But for now, yeah, um, you're going to want to talk to that. I guess there's two people here. Yeah, you can talk to the frog. Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, I love the uh, commitment to the bit. Live and friend. That's not it. Self conscious or drinking for. Oh, he doesn't know. He doesn't get it. He doesn't get it. So, this is an apothecary. They sell Healy things. Mm hmm. Yep. That's that. Right. Uh, but there's one more lad in here that we want to buy from. They're that cactus looking friend. And that is a, another member of the consortium of Fida. And therefore, uh, a very good merchant. You can see, I mean, they have crystal boots. They'll have other crystal goods um, from time to time. Uh, high voltage arc winder is a very good gun. I think we had that at one point. Mm hmm. We did. Um, well, they don't have anything of interest to us right now. So that's actually kind of nice because we don't have, I don't, I hate it when the, you know, we're look, window shopping when we don't have the money to pay for it. So um, why don't we go ahead and, and uh, oh, I guess we should, there's one more thing we have to see. We want to head, I think, south. Yeah, staircase there. We can do an auto explore here. We might get some free goodies. Oh, what is trauma plate? I forgot there was a becoming nook here. Hmm. Interesting. One I mean, shot implant. You can grab it and sell it, but. Uh... Now, OK, so you see that chamber in that room? Mm -hmm. That is um, a fully functioning uh, kind of stasis pod. And if ever we lose a limb, we can um, use that. Not indefinitely, like it only has a certain number of uses in it. Might even only be one use, but we can use it to regrow our limbs. Okay. Does it only work while it's got drams of homogenized convalescence? Yeah. So uh, at a, after a certain number of times, it'll we'll spend the homogenized part, and it just becomes filled with convalescence, and then we have to be, fill it. We're well, not fill it, but put one dram of cloning draw in it, and it becomes homogenized again. Uh, I guess not. I thought maybe we could uh, get some free tonics, but we can't. All right. 
Um, do we want to recoil the Jopa? I don't, but you seem real hyped on it, so... It's not that I... It's, it said it's a, a shortcut across the world. Not tonics. Jopa. Jopa. Zoop. There it is. I'm like, where is the one we just bought? Chopa. Nice. We did right. it. Before we end, um, we're going to have a quick look at our quests. And we're going to scroll down. You don't want to discuss them one by one? No. Hmm. <laughs> No, I do not. Oh. Return to Grit Gate, apparently. But um, we got to do this one. So the spread clank in the asphalt mine, deep in the earth, 20 strata. Oof. Six day stilt, that'll be an easy one. Um, onto a water skin, that's really easy. Onto a hammock. Wow, you got some really easy ones there. Well, we can probably do the hammock, water skin, six day stilt, and asphalt mines. And actually, if we wanted to do the 20 strata deep, the easiest way to do that is that if we went to the asphalt mines and went 20 strata deep. Food for thought. Okay. But um, <clears throat> we could, if we find a hammock, just like shortcut that. I think probably the easiest way to do the hammock is if we went to the six day stilt. They might have some hammocks there. Or We've maybe definitely a, passed a hammock before. I just don't remember where. Maybe an Ezra, because they have a lot of trees. So we could try. We could check out Ezra. Might have been Ezra. So we'll, in the next episode, we're going to be checking those boxes. We'll go to the Six Day Stilt and do that one and Asphalt Mines because they're very close together. Uh, the Water Skin we can do whenever. We can do it now even, but. Uh, you want to do a preview? Sure. You just got to drop it. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I get it. You got I it. I get it. You got it. All right. And you have an activated ability somewhere. There you go. There you go. Worth noting that you get some experience for that. If you did all of the places that Clank wants... Um, I believe you would get experience for all of them. I think? I can't remember. It might be that once you do four, it just, you shed Clank. Might mm. also be that you can't shed Clank and he counts as, an, as a fungal infection and you have to purge him as you would any fungal infection. So there is that all right. as well. We'll look forward to more of that. Yep. If you're enjoying next the step. series. Next step. Hit the button. Hit all the buttons. Hit them. Like it. Subscribe it. Talk right. about fungal infections in the chat. Yeah. All right. Uh, send us links to your favorite Batman drinking water. What's your favorite Cathedra? Yeah. What's the most expensive thing you've ever bought in Caves of Cud? Show off. Thank you. Goodbye. Okay,